Hey everyone, in this video I'll be unboxing four of these Harry Potter Funko Mystery Minis. I usually don't buy these sorts of things because of the whole mystery part and I like to know what I'm buying and I'm scared of duplicates, but I saw these and I mean, how cute are they? I just had to finally try these sorts of things out because I remember wanting those blind bags, I think they were called, and they had keychains inside them. I just couldn't bring myself to buy those, but these were just pretty much too cute to resist and hopefully I have a good experience with it. If I do, I'll probably buy more, but uh, probably being the keyword there. So now since I have four of these, I will tell you the top four that I hope to get in these boxes, and I will also mention a couple that I hope to not get. My top four are obviously Dobby, because he's my favorite of the lot. The next three are probably Hedwig, Hagrid, and I guess Dumbledore. I mean, I'll be fine with getting any of these, to be honest, except for the cat version of McGonagall. Not that it isn't cute, because I am a cat person and I love cats, I just don't really care to get it. And Scabbers, because, ugh, I mean, he just reminds me of Peter Pettigrew and, you know, no. Again, I find the figure cute, but I just don't really care to get it. But I mean, I'll be thrilled if I don't get a duplicate. I'll call that a win and a good experience. So let me just start opening these up and see what I get. All right, first box. Oh, I'm so nervous. Oh, easy to open. <gasps> oh my God! I got Hagrid! Oh my God! Yay, he's the one of the ones I wanted! Oh my god, my heart! <laughs> oh, I was so excited I knocked my camera a little bit. <laughs> oh, he's so cute! Oh, I can't. I'm like literally just over emotional right now. Oh gosh. Okay, good. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna keep going. Okay, I'm excited now. I'm so excited now. That was a good start. Oh my god. Like literally, I think I have tears in my eyes. <laughs> it's not oh it's Draco he's a little dirty you see that he's a little dirty oh Draco you know he redeemed himself in the new book I haven't finished it but I'm starting to like his character a lot and he's a Slytherin I'm a Slytherin oh my god Draco okay I'm okay with that not one of the top four I wanted but I'm okay with him okay. you know he felt so tiny like I was shaking the boxes like a lot when I got these and I don't know he felt like totally small inside the box so now I'm confused because I thought I was gonna get two animals because they were like really shaky you know what I mean like see how much that so much noise compared to this one like I don't know if you can tell I don't know okay let's just get through these Oh, Ron! I got Ron! I got Ron! He's cute! That's cool. I like Ron. Okay. So far, so good. I'm happy with what I got. So far! Oh, my last one. Come on. Be a, like a animal like Hedwig or, or Dobby. Please be Dobby! It's not Dobby. I don't think so doesn't feel like it. Oh, it feels like uh, Nagini, I think the snake, you know? Mm. Do I have to get scissors? Hold on, I have scissors. Oh, I was right! Hold on, I have something more. I was right! Nagini! No, Voldemort's snake. Voldemort's snake. I'm a Slytherin and I like snakes obviously because of that fact but I'm really happy with Hagrid because look at him so at least I got one of the ones that I wanted like my top four and I didn't get any of the ones I didn't want and then I have these they're just I really like Draco now that I you know he kind of redeemed himself in the new book 
And of course, I love Ron because he's one of the golden trio. And yeah, little Nightini. So, this was a good experience. I, I thought it was going to be like duplicates and characters I didn't necessarily want and it just ended up pretty well. I really, I'm really happy, especially with Hagrid. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Oh, and of course, thanks for watching.